It's never about the destination, it's always about the journey. Good morning and welcome to Queen's Park. C'est un grand honneur pour moi d'être ici avec vous aujourd'hui. Bonjour tout le monde. And I'm honored to be here to be part of the start of this annual National Peace Officers Memorial Run. And I bring greetings and warmest wishes for a successful run from our Premier, the Honourable Doug Ford, and Chief DemQ and Command Leaders, and Mark and Tom and Jason and Shelley, and all elected officials and all distinguished guests, a warm welcome. Public safety exacts a heavy toll. And for so many, but especially the families, the memories are still fresh, and so is their pain. This year has been difficult, but to the families here, there is no loss greater than the loss of your own loved one. And we know that. But we need to remember the lives we've been given to continue on, even on days that seem absolutely impossible. In a few days on this coming Sunday, we will gather together in Ottawa to converge at the National uh, Police Officers Day. I was there last year, and I'll be there this year. And last year I saw for myself it is a solemn experience, and we all carry it with a heavy heart. And people will arrive in Ottawa by foot and by bicycle and motorbike and vehicles with the same goal, to pay tribute to those who we lost. And it wasn't long that we were here before. It wasn't so long that we were here before at our Ontario Police Memorial. I looked at the names that were recently engraved on this wall. By starting the run here and the journey here, you get to be part of something so much larger than our own individual selves. And this is incredible. There's a line from the English poet John Milton that perhaps sums up the emotions we feel today. They also serve who only stand and wait. So many stood and waited for their husbands and their wives and their partners and their loved ones so they could serve. And they kept us safe. I have to tell you, the people that keep us safe every day understand the risks. Understand the risks they have every day when they leave their homes. And we want them to know we will wait for them. Because when you serve, you give something that is part of our inherent right, something that the Premier and I and our government and everybody here at our home of democracy believes in, a right to live safely in our own homes and communities, a right to take our kids to school, a right to go to work and to shop and to play in the park and to pray. And here at this auspicious place, we believe in freedom and democracy, and we know there must be a point in our lives when we have to act in defense of it, because some things have to matter. The rule of law must matter, public safety must matter. And throughout my travels all over Ontario, there has never been, and I have seen this for myself, there has never been a more committed government than our government led by Premier Ford who believes in our public safety, who believes in having the backs of everyone that keeps Ontario safe. And we're very proud of this. This has been a tough year. And we remember today and every day, Andrew and Devon and Morgan and Greg and Eric. During this journey to Ottawa, please keep their names in your hearts. Like a rock thrown into a pond, a person who has achieved excellence creates ripples of inspiration, leaving a lasting impact on those all around them. As long as we live, they too will live. They are now a part of us, and we remember them. Let us all be grateful to still be on the journey together. Thank you. Merci beaucoup and me quitch.